data has grown to be one of the most important and valuable assets for organizations. Your business collects large amounts of data every day. Data helps you to better understand your business and your customers. Great! But you need data that you can trust to accelerate and grow the business faster than ever before. The key is to be accountable for your data and understand how to manage it. Sure, it may be tempting to ignore or deprioritize it. But the truth is, ensuring the quality and protection of data yields valuable insights and benefits for the business. Deriving insights from data can help you grow product sales, acquire new customers, retain and engage existing customers, improve HR planning, lower inventory costs, and much, much more. So, how do you manage your data? Well, to get your basics right, you should appoint a data protection officer, develop effective data policies and processes, and implement robust controls and practices for ICT systems. Let's dive a little deeper. First, appoint at least one person in your business as a Data Protection Officer or DPO. Your DPO will oversee data management, ensuring that your company stays compliant with the Personal Data Protection Act. Don't forget to register him so that he stays abreast of regulatory updates and trends on data protection. Next, to develop effective data policies and processes, your business needs a data protection policy, a data breach management plan, and a staff communications and training plan. A data protection policy sets the importance and clarity of how data should be handled by internal stakeholders and shows external stakeholders that your company is taking responsibility for the data in its care. A data breach management plan helps an organization to prepare and respond to data breaches effectively. Adopt the CARE framework to formulate a robust data breach response plan. Contain the breach, assess the risks, report to PDPC or affected individuals where applicable, evaluate response and review actions to prevent future breaches. Check out our guide on managing and notifying data breaches for more information. As for our staff communications and training plan, it builds a strong data protection culture by implementing continual education for all staff, regardless of role or function. Look for more information in our Data Protection Starter Kit checklist and refer to the list of data protection as a service providers to help you implement the checklist. Lastly, it's important to ensure your ICT systems are secure. You can do this by establishing data protection policies and risk management for ICT systems, implementing appropriate ICT controls and developing standard procedures and processes. Here are a few examples of good basic data protection practices. Control access to your data and services. Use strong passwords to protect data. Guard against phishing and malware. Choose the most secure setting for your devices and software. For more detailed recommendations, check out our compilation of good data protection practices that you can implement for your ICT systems and our handbook on how to guard against common types of data breaches with its accompanying hand and checklist for easy reference. With these simple measures in place, you too can protect the data invaluable to your business. For more helpful information, check out our links in the description below the video. Better data, better business.